the electrifying young phenom himself, Memphis Grizzlies all-world <laughs> superstar, Ja Morant. Ja, I feel like I was introducing you into a WWE ring, but you deserve the introduction. <laughs> so welcome to First Take. We'll get right into it. <laughs> Clippers, Suns, I mean, Hawks. Charlie, it looked it look like he didn't put on like 10 pounds of muscle. He trying well, to I mean, look stand like up there with his arms folded, <laughs> with his chest, yeah, with his chest He's poked chilling. out of things. Look, ain't nobody afraid of all that, man. <laughs> Let's <laughs> lighten up a little bit, all right? <laughs> Real men wear purple. Let's go. Okay, Jock, ja, Clippers, Suns, Bucks, Hawks, only one champion can be crowned on this show, and we are not afraid to make bold takes, you already know. So who does Ja Morant have winning the title this year? Uh... Tough question, you know. Um, I really, you know, don't care too much on, you know, who wins it. I just, I just want the rest of the series to go to seven, so you know we can have, you know, more basketball. Okay. Obviously, the, you know, team you know, across my shirt. That's who I want to win it. Okay, you don't mm. care who wins, but we need you to choose. <laughs> All right, because we see you on Twitter, we see you on social media. You always have something to say, so we need your hot take. Who's gonna win? <laughs> Oh, man. Uh, I might have to say, you know, the Suns. I feel like, you know, they're playing, you know, uh, real well right now. Mm. All right. Good answer. Hey, so, hey, Ja, look, you know, I follow you on Twitter. I watch you do, I, you watch a lot of basketball like we all do. You go voice your opinion about the game. All right, it was one in particular tweet. I, would, I needed an explanation about and I wanted to talk to you about, okay? Paul George had an off night, right? Yeah. And you tweeted out, I can't really say the yeah. extra, but you tweeted out, you said, bleep, it's so quick to criticize Paul George, right? And I felt some type of way about that because I'm one of those guys who's very <laughs> critical of Paul George and I have my reasons why, but I just want to ask you, okay? You a guy that's also very vocal when, while you're playing, or, or you you like active in the social media world when you tweet out during the game, whether you lose or whether you win, you'll come back. You always deliver. You you comment to criticism. You embrace it. What's the difference with PG? People criticize you, and you prove them wrong. You're right. You're right. But I mean, I can't speak, you know, uh, for another man. Uh, you know. Obviously, you know, I feel like, uh, you know, he's a, you know, very talented player. Uh, I feel like, you know, he's been playing well as mm -hmm. of late. Um, but I know you. Um, I, I read your tweets, too. And when when the respect is due, you you will give it to a player. So some people just get, some people just don't do that. I hmm. mean, and, and listen, I know Monica is next, but I've been having this dog over here at my house for the longest. You still haven't texted me, send me your address or nothing. I don't know what to do with it. You know what I mean? So let me know. Yeah, I need it. I'm going to text you right after this. I need it. Um, <laughs> all right, so let me do this. First of all, y'all, shout out to you. Thank you for the tweet when y'all beat the Warriors because then my Twitter following took off. So it's nice to meet you for the first time. <laughs> Everybody was like, do you know him? I was like, no, I just picked, I picked the Grizzlies. Um, I also will say the Memphis Grizzlies uh, fan base show mad love. But we do want to hear about your documentary, The Promised Land. So please tell us about that. It's super dope what you're mm. doing away from the court. Um, it's pretty much, you know, uh, just goes into deeper detail on my journey. Um, you know, tell people a lot more about, uh, you know, me that, you know, they really don't know. Um, obviously, you know, going from small town kid to, you know, the number two pick to, you know, winning rookie of the year is, you know, um, uh, not often, you know, seen before. So, um, it just goes into, you know, detail on, you know, how I got to this point in my life. Okay, so you have a lot going on right now. One thing that you will not have to worry about is the Summer Olympics. You were not chosen to compete this summer. Do you feel slighted being left off the team? What would it have meant to you to go and compete for the gold? Um, as of now, it just means, you know, just, you know, I got to work harder. Um, you know, I just got to, you know, prove that, you know, I'm one of the, you know, top players in this league also. And, um, you know, eventually, um, you know, Everything, you know, that I feel like I deserve will, you know, fall into place as long as, you know, I'm handling my business. Definitely. Uh, wiser words could not be spoken in, in that regard. But, Ja, we got to ask you, speaking of competitions and all that good stuff, can we expect to see you 
Ja Morant, the high-flying phenom that you are, <laughs> in the 2022 dunk contest, my guy. He better. Uh, he better man. be. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I don't know yet. I don't know yet. Okay, so what 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 will help you decide? What are the factors? Because we need we need to just so we can keep an eye on them uh -huh. and you know try to predict. <laughs> uh. I just need, uh, you know, some good competition, number one. Ooh. Um, oh. Oh. I don't need, no, mm. don't need no biased judges. Mmm. Um, <laughs> you know, I'd be in a dunk contest. Right. All right. Okay. I I'm curious how many times you practice a certain dunk before entering a contest like that. How many reps do you think you get in? Uh... It just depends on, you know, the difficulty of the dunk. Um, some of them might be, you know, first, second try. Some might take longer. You know, you just got to have the time enough. Okay, fair enough. Okay, well, let's talk about a real highlight. Ja Raffi at the <laughs> Memphis Zoo was named after you. How much of a highlight was that for you to hear about? I mean, that's pretty cool. Are you planning on meeting your new friend this summer? Have you taken your daughter to see him? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Um, I actually, you know, went and seen, uh, you know, right after, um, you know, they announced it. And my daughter has, you know, been there also. Um, we, Me and my daughter got to go back again to, you know, see mm -hmm. uh, my other son, her brother again. <laughs> <laughs> that is amazing. Yeah. So cool. Ja Raffi, Ja Morant, <laughs> thank you so much for being here on First Take. We know big things coming your way. So thank you so much. We appreciate you. Appreciate you, young No problem. Fella. Appreciate y'all for having me. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.